Keenan Shan Olds here, West Virginia Land and Home Realty at 8544 Hill Road in Rio, West Virginia. Uh, we got a couple things going on here. Down here is the house, which is a cinder block house, but it's, don't be fooled, it's really, really nice inside. It's about, uh, oh, a little over a thousand square foot or so. And it's got a partial basement in it uh, that's uh, somewhat finished. There's a kind of like a bar down there. Had a little pool hall going on down there. And uh, right here is Ford Hill Road. And as you look up that short mountain, there's uh, 8,000 acres of public hunting in there. And the access to it's about a mile down the road from here. But uh, looks can be deceiving. I'm going to walk you in this barn. It's incredible. And there's five acres here. There's a big field back here behind the house that belongs to it. But check out this barn, all custom work. This thing's built like a fortress. It's not going anywhere. I think a tornado would bounce off of it. But uh, that shelves behind those uh, sliding barn doors there. And of course, drawers there below the workbench. And this thing's 40 by 70. And of course, we're on the main level and there's a full basement under it uh, that's got electricity down there on a the dirt floor. And then there's another story right up here above where I'm at. It's like a platform up there, uh, you know, for, for storage and whatnot. I don't know. It might be uh, 40 by 20, maybe. And then you got this separate room over here. And uh, another room back here that's, he's got electricity in it, like a little work room. And then here's where you go up to the, to the loft up there. I'll try not to walk too fast to make anybody sick. But uh, there's also like a little garage bay underneath of it as well that, that you can lock up. And then there's uh, this room right here. Uh, well, there we go. Just a little dry room here. The owner used to keep his hunting stuff in here and everything, but... Uh, <laughs> it's hard to tell what it would cost to build this barn if you had to start from scratch today. And uh, you just have to see the timbers underneath this thing. It's incredible. I mean, it's really built like a fortress. Good electricity in here. It's got an exhaust fan up there to take the heat out of here if it's hot. But uh, it's, it's very, very, very nice. I mean, workshop, barn, whatever you want to make it. Keenan Shan holds here, video number two, 8544 Ford Hill Road. This is the house here. It's concrete block, so it's not going anywhere. But uh, I'm gonna walk you in here so that uh, you can see this. It fools you. You got ceramic tile floors, nice kitchen. Uh, well, let me get the lights on here. A very big bathroom with ceramic tile. That's made for a stackable washer and dryer in that closet. Shower and tub. And here's a bedroom here. Let me get some lights on. Two bedroom house, one bath. Uh, like I said, it's a little over a thousand square feet. Uh, this would be your dining room area. And then this will be the living room here. Uh, there used to be a, a carpet over top of this flooring right there. So that section of floor could look like that section of floor. It just needs finish. And then here's the steps that go downstairs into the finished part of the basement down there. And then you got another bedroom in here. It's laminate flooring in here, but uh, you know, a good sized bedroom. So uh, it's got log siding for the walls. Um, it's heated by a wood stove and there's duct work ran underneath the house. Uh, the wood stove needs a blower on it. It doesn't work right now, but that's how he heated the house. So this thing wouldn't be a good candidate for like a, any type of government back loan because it doesn't have a hardwired heat source. Um, but uh, it's a lot of bang for the buck here. You got that huge barn, a place to live, five acres, unrestricted, no HOA, very close to 8,000 acres of public hunting land. Um, it's just, just really nice. If you want to live the simple life, it don't get much simpler.